almost 15 percent of our province's potato crop is being destroyed wow. because of a bug found in the soil of two local farms. Sonia Sanger reports. From the barn to the conveyor belt to the, to the truck. Thousands of tons of seed potatoes are being laid out to rot at this Fort Saskatchewan area farm. Our livelihood has completely disappeared. Between this farm and the other farm, uh, I think you'll be approaching uh, 25,000 tons. More than half of these potatoes would have been destined for the U.S. or Mexico, but because of a parasite found in the soil of two local farms, those borders are now closed, forcing these potatoes to sit here and freeze. In October, tests showed soil at a farm in Spruce Grove, and this one near Fort Saskatchewan, contained potato cyst nematode, a microscopic parasite that lives in the soil. The only impact it really has on the crop is it reduces production. So that it re reduces yield. It's an economic impact, not a health impact at all. The actual potatoes are fine to eat, but because they're used to grow other potatoes, there's a risk of spreading the parasite. The border to the U.S. and Mexico is now closed to the seeds. Potato growers say they could lose up to $35 million this year alone. There's a lot of fear and trepidation in the potato industry uh, because the border is not open now. Sonia Sunger, CTV News, Fort Saskatchewan. About 60 growers across Alberta are affected by the border closures. Canadian potato seed growers outside our province are still free to sell to the U.S. and Mexico, but it's too soon to know exactly how this will affect potato prices.